Hello techies in the previous tutorial we have learned how to copy a file from source to destination folder within OneDrive by using copy file and copy file using path actions in layman language we have done copy and paste a file from one folder to another folder in OneDrive now in this session we will learn how to move a file from one folder to another folder by using move or rename a file action. Let me show you a small use case. Let me go to OneDrive and then I'm going to select the folder Power Automate Desktop. Now, if you observe, I'm having a lot of files over here. In a such a way, we are having a folder, we are having documents, PDFs, exe files, PPT files, and many more. Let us assume I want to move a file from Power Automate desktop folder to the destination folder. In a such a way, I want to cut a file over here in the Power Automate desktop folder and I have to move to another folder that is destination folder. All right. There, if you see, I'm having a file called MVA.PDF. I want to move this file into the destination folder. In the destination folder, if you see, I don't have any PDF file and with the name of MOA.PDF also I don't have. How can I go ahead and move the file from one folder to another folder by using OneDrive for Business Actions as part of the Power Automate desktop? Now there is the action called move or rename file. Let me drag and drop this action onto the workspace. The main purpose of this move or rename a file action is to move on renaming a file from one folder to another folder. If you see the parameters over here, first one is the file. File is nothing but unique identifier file which we are going to give as part of this file parameter. The second parameter is the destination file path. In this parameter, we are going to give the path for the destination folder. All right. And the third parameter, if you see overwrite, we are having three options over here. One is omit, true, and false. Most of the time we are going to give it true because if there is any file which is already available in the particular folder, if I want to overwrite on that file, in that case, I'm going to use true. And if you see the advanced parameter, I'm having timeout. These parameters we have seen in many actions as part of the OneDrive. All right. Before going to give the parameters for move or rename a file action, First of all, I will get the metadata by using get file metadata action. Let me drag and drop this get file metadata action onto the workspace. By using get file metadata action, I will get the metadata or the information about the particular file. In our case, I'm going to use MOA.PDF, which is available in Power Automate Desktop. I want to get the information about that file. How can I go ahead and do that? By using file over here. I'm going to select the file over here that is available in root subfolder as Power Automate Desktop. And there you can see I'm having MOA.PDF. And the output will be stored in the get file metadata response as part of get file metadata action. All right, let me click on save. Now I'm going to use move or rename a file action. Let me drag and drop this action onto the workspace. Now, if you see the parameters, the first one is the file. In the file, I can go ahead and I can select as is in a such a way like root, Power Automate Desktop. And then I can go ahead and I can select a file, whichever you are looking to move from one folder to another folder. This is statically we are going to use it. But right now what I'm going to do, I'm going to use the variable that the variable I will select from the output of get file metadata. All right, I am going to select the variable over here as get file metadata dot id in this file we have to give the unique identifier of the particular file now unique identifier is nothing but id over here now the second parameter is the destination file path what is the destination file path i am having destination folder is my destination path and then if you see the name of the file is MOA. if i want to rename it with some other name in that case, I'm going to rename it also by using this one. Now, I'm going to give it as Power Automate Desktop MOA.PDF. 
I'm going to give the name like this. Actually, our name is MOA dot PDF in the file name, but I'm going to use destination file path as destination folder slash PAD MOA dot PDF with the renaming. That is the target file name and overwrite. I'm going to use it as true. And then if you go for the advanced timeout, I'm not going to use anything over here. And whatever the action performs, the output such as the properties will be stored in the variable called move file response variable. That is flow variable. In that one, we'll have ID, name, path, and many things we available in that move file response output flow variable. All right, let's click on save. Now, once we are going to run this desktop flow, what will happen? Whatever the file we have selected in the source folder, that is moa.pdf file, will be moved from source folder to the destination folder permanently. I mean to say, this will be like cut and paste over there in the destination folder. All right. Now, let's run the flow to see the output. Flow execution started. As a first step, it is trying to get the information by using get file metadata and then it is trying to move the file from source to destination by using move or rename file action now if you see over here let me refresh this source folder there if you see in my source folder i don't have moa.pdf file what happened it has been moved to some other folder that is destination folder let me go back to the destination folder in onedrive there you can see there is a file has been created or moved with the name of padmoa.pdf file. In a layman language, it's a simply cut and paste a particular file from one folder to another folder. All right. I hope you understand how to work with move or rename a file action as part of this tutorial.